probably noticed by now that the facility isn't in great shape. It's a long story, so I'll cut it short. The Central Corps in charge of maintaining the facility has been put out of commission. I tried to look after the place in her absence, but I don't have the tools. Good news, though. I found better tools. A device capable of repairing the whole enrichment center. Only problem is that only a human can turn it on, so I hoped maybe you could fill in that role for me? The life of every human in core in the facility is at risk if we don't stop the collapse. Come on, let's go. I'll explain the rest on the way. We need to get closer to the surface. I found an elevator in this direction. Up ahead is the turret disposal facility. Since they're all defective, they shouldn't be able to hurt you, but still be careful. Poor turrets. You might think that their pain is only simulated, but how is it different to yours or mine? They really don't deserve to be shredded, but don't worry. All their scrap will be recycled for production, and only surplus turrets get shredded after all. So, I'm looking through your records, and I see you have a family. How are the kids? Oh, oh no. Uh, you, you know what? Uh, forget I asked that. I'm so sorry. Ah, wind turbines. Of course. Try not to get blown away too much. These things can get supersonic if you turn them up. way across that bridge. I'm sure you'll figure it out, so I will wait right ahead.
How does it feel to be an official amateur employee? Yeah, must be great. Though on that topic, don't try running off without me, okay? Yes, I made up the human emergency response team, but so what? It can still be real. You are human, this is quite an emergency, and you are responding to it. Not quite a team yet, though. Hmm. No, no, a team can't consist of one person, that doesn't make sense. I could get more people, but that seems like a lot of work. You know what? I think we two make a great team in of itself. We might not make a fully human team, but you can't always get what you want. Semi-human? I'll go with that. To get back on topic, here's my proposal. You help me repair the facility, and I'll let you leave. Observation facility. Humans had to sit here all day and watch you test subjects solve the chambers. In real time, too. Imagine. Observation room on the other side that can take you to the elevators. I'm sure you can find another way in there. You're pretty resourceful. what you need. Any other repairs, I'll have to assign back to you. Also, try not to die. I'm tired of mopping up human blood. That red never gets out.
Congratulations, you broke the sign. Is this some kind of message you're sending me? Surprise for you after this last little hurdle. I know, I know. I promise no more test. Wait, no, I didn't. <laughs> well then, here you go. I'll wait up ahead and uh, prepare some things. Take your time.
face. Did you expect something bad? Yes. It's an actual elevator straight to the surface. Rare find. You're welcome, by the way. I know you humans love the sky for some reason, so I thought this would excite you. Look, I know what you're thinking. You really don't trust me. And I've done nothing but sounding like a raving lunatic or a sociopath. Probably both at once, if I'm gonna be honest. In the interest of transparency, this elevator will take you up to the surface. Uh, only thing is, it's not all the way out of the enrichment center. When we get to the surface, we still have a little way to go before we can complete your half of the deal. I'll try to help you where I can with these old test chambers, but uh, there's been a lot of decay, if you catch my drift. But hey, look at the bright side. There's fresh air, it's sunny outside, and I think there's a cool breeze. Just watch out for wild animals. Those are brutal. With any luck, this should take just a few minutes, and then you can go free. Hope we're in the clear now.